Hey friends, I miss you and I hope that you're doing well. I'm excited to share with you today some poems from Lizards, Frogs, and Pollywogs. A special shout out to Douglas Florian for being the author and illustrator and a Voyager Books, a trademark of Harcourt Incorporated out of Orlando, Austin, New York, Toronto, and London. The Tortoise. I wear a helmet on my back. It's hard and guards me from attack. And if I wheeze or sneeze or cough, the shell I dwell in won't fall off. It's glued without a screw or mortise. I'm born with it, for I'm a tortoise. The Gecko. The gecko's trick is climbing walls, like glue it sticks and rarely falls. Across the ceiling, it may roam, but don't you try this in your home. The iguana. I wouldn't wanna be an iguana. Iguanas are covered with scales. I wouldn't wanna be an iguana. Iguanas can have spiny tails. I wouldn't wanna be an iguana. Iguanas are sometimes green. I wouldn't wanna be an iguana, except for Halloween. The Cobra. It's wise to stay clear of the dangerous Cobra all months of the year, including October. The Komodo Dragon. I am a Komodo. I'm gruesome and gray. The most massive lizard that's living today. Birds and boars for me are a meal, plus all those who don't think that dragons are real. The box turtle. This bony dome's my mobile home, a shell so swell in which to roam. And when I'm scared by bear or fox, inside I hide safe in my box. I close it shut and go to bed, secure from beasts, that box my head. The python. With 30 feet to squeeze your prey. Pythons, you take my breath away. The glass frog. Upon a tree, it's hard to see which part is leaf and which part is me. Which part is me and which is leaf? I lost myself again. Good grief. The 